Hello, <laughs> it's me again. Um, so I wanted to record this and kind of show my process of these um, concept art for um, Ari in Wonderland. So this is what I'm making today. Uh, so I have um, props that Ari uses. Uh, so these are me drawing him interacting with the props. We have him using the bat, the cards, uh, eating the um, health cake, but I'll pull the picture right here. These are all on my portfolio, which are linked. Um, I don't know that I have a link on my YouTube. They're linked to my Instagram, but I'll fix that. Uh, hopefully by the time this is up, I'll have that fixed. But we have him eating the health cake, uh, the racket, the mallet. <laughs> and then all the glass and the cutlery. So I'm gonna fix these and um, poly uh, you know, make them actual drawings so that I can post them on my portfolio. So we're gonna go through the process of that. Right now I have these messy sketches. I need to clean up some of them. Um, what I'm gonna do next is uh, basically clean these up. I'm not gonna draw the clothes yet I want to make sure I have the anatomy right first and then I will get back to you guys after all of that
So we've got the main sketch done. Um, one thing I would do in Clip Studio, I don't know if you noticed, but I'm using uh, Photoshop uh, color overlay. I'm going to make this blue. So those are now blue. I'm going to turn it to multiply. I don't know if that does anything. Maybe I have to make this multiply. I don't know. I'm learning Photoshop. So, <laughs> okay. We're just going to turn this down. Okay. Does it work with... Interesting. Okay. We're just going to get rid of this then. Ooh. There we go, we got rid of it. Uh, can I just get rid of the effects? There we go. We did it, yay! <laughs> okay, I'm just going to do this instead. We're going to get the colors. I'm going to just fill it in. I'm going to ignore all layers. I'm going to make it a clipping layer. Now they're all blue. Merge it down. Go to multiply it and then turn them down. So now what I need to do is clean up these lines and then we're going to color it and I will maybe check back. <laughs> I feel like this is pretty self-explanatory by just watching what I'm doing. Um, yeah. So let's just go ahead and get into it.
So we have cleaned up the sketch layer. Let me merge these two. All right, so debating whether I'm gonna cheat and just use this. I probably will just do that and save myself some time. So we started with this. It wasn't too bad. And we've gone from that to this. I do like his face better in this one. I think something about this area here is a little offset. It's probably, um, let's see, probably like the shape of his head. Let me change the color. And the way his hair is, like this here kind of goes in like this, instead of following what would be the shape of his head. So let me fix that. And this here, just add like some hair right there, and then I think that should be fine. Yeah, that looks better. Okay. I do really like how this back came out. <laughs> uh, poor little guy all messed up there. It's a little skewed. <laughs> here I'm just looking through and fixing all the things that need to be fixed adding the details I forgot to add okay so next is the coloring um, I'm not gonna go into detail on my coloring I think I do want to make a video about color theory and the reasons on uh, my reasons for choosing specific colors. So, for now, we're gonna just watch me color. <laughs> and then, another day, I will go into detail on the choices I make for colors. So, let's go ahead and get the coloring started. It's gonna be a long, it's gonna be fun.
interrupt Intru this is going great I've just started anyway let me interrupt your little you know watching of my video to show you this um, I uploaded my sketchbook to Gumroad and it's available for purchase on Friday and that's gonna be Friday the 19th um, the minimum is $10 uh, I got some examples right here, and this is in a PDF. This is my first upload to Gumroad, so if there's some stuff I should have done better, I'll do it for next time. Um, I do have a few additional pages I will show you. Uh, so I got some of my studies from uh, Tom Foxtraws, um, uh, he's on Instagram. We got, oops, maybe page 19, has some cute little character interactions, Willow and her cool uh, Houdini outfit. We got this, <laughs> uh, well, my nephew got the sketchbook, yeah. We got Aiden and what could be his little girl in the future, and then this could be Will Ari's little boy in the future? Who knows? The world is unopen- I don't know. It's possible. <laughs> and then the last preview is a study of these, um, Madikin Chun and Kan- Kan? That I have, um, I got for Christmas. And yeah, those are what- Some of the stuff that's contained in this book. There's, uh, 90 pages. Too much pizzazz. <laughs> Uh, it's 112 millibytes, megabytes, <laughs> millibytes, um, yeah, um, thanks for, uh, listening, or if you didn't and you skipped over, that's fine too, uh, <laughs> but thanks a lot, I hope you enjoy the video, and if you purchase this, I hope, uh, you enjoy it, and it, uh, helps you feel inspired to draw, and thank you very much, and God bless. Okie dokie, so we're all done. <laughs> oh, I changed the... I don't know, some of my photos have gray in the back and some of them have white, which is inconsistent and probably not good um, for a portfolio. Let me pull up my <laughs> portfolio on the other page. Uh, let's see. Nope, not that one. <laughs> um, let's see, let's do this instead. Excuse me while I pull up my portfolio on the other page. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm just gonna look at this real quick and see all of these are white pages so I'm gonna go with white today <laughs> so then I'm gonna go ahead and export this and just call it a uh, plot interaction alrighty well that's pretty much it 
That's all I have. <laughs> I think I need to change the uh, these props that are just white. But I'll do that off camera. Thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And have a good rest of your day. God bless. I have to get away. Get away.